Commander? You probably shouldn't call me that. <laughs> I probably shouldn't even be wearing this uniform. Yeah, hell of a thing. We broke our oath to defend the Alliance so we can keep it. What happens if this doesn't work out, Shepard? We mutinied, stole a prototype warship, if they wanted to get technical, they could throw in kidnapping. We're a hell of an example of humanity's best and brightest, huh? I don't know about the example part, but as far as saving the galaxy, how good are first-timers supposed to be? <laughs> Fair enough. It'll really hit the fan when we get to Ilos. If things don't go well, I want you to know... Well... I've enjoyed serving under you. You're still hesitating? After all we've been through together... What are you afraid of? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, the regs against fraternization seem kind of petty now. Taking a stolen ship to face a giant extra-galactic war machine. You know what? You're right. About everything. I think about losing you, and I can't stand it. And the galaxy will just keep going. Everything, even the Reapers, will come around again. But you and I... We... are important right now. And this is what will never happen again. Us. Shepard, you make me feel... human. I can make you feel much more than that. Come here. Is that an order, Commander? Shut up and get over here. Careful, Shepard. I might think that you're abusing your authority. A serious breach of protocol. It's been a long time since I've met a woman who, uh... Bridge to Commander Shepard. We're five minutes out from the Mew Relay. You know, I don't think I have all my stress worked out yet. Joker's waiting for you on the bridge. I swear, though, if anything happens to you, take care, Shepard. Commander? We've got company. Have their sensors picked us up yet? Well, stealth systems are engaged. Unless we get close enough for a visual, they won't have any idea we're here. Picking up some strange readings from the planet's surface. Take us down, Joker. Lock in on the coordinates. Negative on that, Commander. The nearest landing zone's two clicks away. We'll never make it in time on foot. Get us something closer. There is nowhere closer! I've looked! Drop us in the Mako. You need at least a hundred meters of open terrain to pull off a drop like that. The most I can find near Saren is twenty. Twenty meters? We'll never get in close enough for a drop. We have to try. Find another landing zone. There is no other landing zone! The descent angle's too steep. It's our only option. It's not an option. It's a suicide run. We don't... I can do it. Joker? I can do it. Gear up and head down to the Mako. Joker, drop us right on top of that bastard.
at this bunker before Saren finds the conduit. There's no way we're getting past that door with brute force. Saren found some way to open it. There must be some kind of security override somewhere in this complex. We'll have to find some way to get it up and running again.
I think we're good, Commander. The city is too quiet. This place still has power. It must be running off its own generator. I bet this is the command center for the entire conference troops must have sealed the doors from here after he went inside. We'll have to figure out how to disengage the security lockdown if we ever want to get inside that bunker.